Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're here for the theories episode 17. Okay guys, we all know this episode is about enchanted Halloween costumes which were enchanted by CC King who is working with VM Imposter who has been spelling out mal for us but let's let's leave that. Anyways, let me just explain this episode briefly, then we can just hop into um, our theories on the mysteries in this episode. Anyways guys, this episode is about these four princesses, Elsa, Anna, Ariel, and Belle, going Halloween shopping, like Halloween outfit shopping, and they take Halloween costumes that are enchanted, when they put them on, they become their characters, Belle becomes the Queen of Hearts, uh, Elsa becomes a witch, Anna becomes Har Harley Queen, and the last thing we expected was Ariel as Jojo Siwa. Guys, if you don't know Jojo Siwa, she's... I don't know how to explain it, but she's a YouTube influencer, kind of like a singer, I don't know. But if you know Jojo Siwa, put it in the comments, guys. So that's what this episode is about. As we all know, everything gets solved at the end. Anyways, guys, everyone becomes their characters, and obviously, they work for the CC King. Guys, this episode, a part of this episode shook me, and we're going to get into that. Guys, I'm just going to take my time to explain this episode, because we have only two mysteries to give our theories on. I'm really sorry. Yeah, guys. But before I continue, I would just like to tell everyone, Happy Halloween! Woohoo! Happy Halloween, guys. Happy Halloween. Trick or treat. Yeah, that kind of stuff. Scary movies, guys. If you go trick or treating on Halloween, guys, what would you dress as? If you ask me, maybe Wonder Woman. I think I'll dress as Wonder Woman or Catwoman. Catwoman from the DC, uh, DC Universe or Wonder Woman. Anyways, guys, so yeah, that's it. That's the explanation of this episode. And let's get into the theories. Let's go. Let's go. So, guys, if we can all remember when CC King was in charge of the princesses when they were evil, CC King was about to tell us who the runaways are. Guys, we know the runaways have been on the chase for a long time. We've we've been like dying to know who the runaways are. We got a hint with a coin saying Phoenix Dragon. And Cinderella also told us that their names start with P and D, so I really got confused at that point. But CC King was about to tell us who the runaways are. Like their names. No hint, nothing. Just straight on the table. But uh, yeah, guys. CC King said the runaways are. And then Mel poofed in and was like, not today, CC King. She turned her friends back into good guys and she left. I was so upset, like, I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry, but Mal, wrong timing. Official wrong timing. We're about to know who the runaways are. Definitely some wrong timing. Like, and I, I was so upset. We would have known who the runaways are by now if she didn't come into the scene. So, Mal, go work on your timing because you have very bad timing. Very bad timing. Okay, on to the next theory. Okay, guys, at the end of this BFFSC Star School of Magic episode, um, Mao said, you know, th the topic of the Moonstone Ring, which Elsa was sent to find and found, was brought up. And Elsa was like, yeah, Mao, I gave it to you this morning. Mao was like, no, no, you didn't. And if you had, I would I, I would know by now. And then Elsa was like, oh, no, Mao, what is it? That Mao, told her, Mao asked her, what is it? And she said, the Moonstone Ring is gone. Because, guys, when I watched the latest Beyond the Bessie Star School Magic episode, when I saw Mal's reaction, she was like, yeah, so much drama. And I was like, this ain't Mal. <laughs> I, I, I didn't even wait to see more reaction from this fake Mal. I, I just said, this isn't Mal. Mal doesn't have this type of mean girl deep voice. Yeah, whatever. Plus, she doesn't go, oh, uh, uh, she doesn't roll her eyes or anything. Plus... Mal got really offended when Elsa said that Maleficent is an evil brat evil. And then she was like, no, totally. That's what I knew Mal is not, is not, 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 that's not Mal. That's an imposter. Guys, really? Anyways, guys, at the end of it, at the end of the episode, Mal and Elsa later realized that the monster ring is gone. Elsa gave it to an imposter and guess who it was, guys? 
It was Maleficent. Maleficent went to Starlight, pretended to be Mal, and got the Moonstone Ring. Wow. Oh, and guys, Elsa mentioned that uh, when she went to uh, to Seabrook to get the Moonstone Ring from Zed and Addison, they were filming Zombies Guys, if you know who Zed and Addison are, if you know the movie Zombies, you know there's Zombies 1 and Zombies 2. Zombies 2, we got the Wolf Pack involved. Guys, I'm not really a fan of Zombies. I'm not such of a fan of Zombies. But I do know characters, and I know half of what happened in the movie, so. And guys, Descendants or Zombies, which one do you prefer? I prefer Descendants, if you ask me. I prefer Descendants. Okay, guys. Anyways, uh, it has been confirmed that next year we're going to get Zombies 3, so I'll wait for it, I guess. I'll just wait for it. Anyways, guys, uh, yeah, we've come to the end of this video because this is the last mystery and we are giving our theories on it. Guys, uh, I want you guys to put your theories in the comments. Who do you think the Runaways are and do you think they're they're going to get the Moonstone Ring back or not? So, yeah, comment that below. And, yeah, so this is the last theory. But, guys, remember, we can never leave without the shoutouts. So, let's get into the shoutouts. Yeah! Anyways, guys, I'm sorry today There's there are no personal shout-outs to give. Shout-out to all my fans. I love you so much. Kiss is full of colors. <laughs> that, that was weird. That was very weird. But, guys, if you want a shout-out, you can comment down below asking for one, and I will definitely give you a shout-out. And, guys, I'm kind of opening up a challenge I'll let you guys know about this little challenge of mine that I'm gonna give to you guys and for myself. Let me just give you a hint. It's kind of like a challenge that we both have to do. All of us. Anyways guys, I'll give you, I'll let you know what the challenge is in my next video. But yeah guys, shout out to all my fans. I love you guys so much. And yeah. Anyways guys, we have come to the end. We have done all the theories. Don't forget to put your theories in the comments because I love to know all your opinions. So yeah guys, this is the end. I'll see you all in my next video. I love you guys so much. Hashtag Vicky Nation. Bye, I love you. Looks just like a city of blinding lights.